What's going on guys? Noah from Kicking Their Bass TV. I know you guys have been wanting a truck tour, truck video. Truck video is going to be coming out soon. We're going to get the drones and everything. It's going to look pretty freaking dope. If you guys haven't seen the Jeep video, go check that out. But for right now, we're going to do a quick tour. I'm going to go through everything. So starting off, this is a 2014 Tundra. Um, and the reason why I got a Toyota, the reason why I got a Tundra is because if I ever go Fish Pro, guys, if I ever go on tour, I'm going to want a Tundra, not only for the Toyota tournaments and stuff, but for the Toyota Bucks, stuff like that. They just have different stuff going on. Um, that's the reason why I faded towards the Toyota rather than the Chevy, the GNC, um, Ford, everything rather than that. Um, actually, one of my buddies is switching from a Ford to a Tundra just for the tournament tournaments in general. But um, they also last a very long time, and I'm really happy with the guys. Um, I really love it. And I didn't think I was gonna like it more than the Jeep, but matter of fact, I really do. But jumping onto the ridges, got two fogs right here. Definitely one of my favorite parts about the truck. Um, super bright, and I can actually ride if it's on, so um, it's freaking awesome. And wait till you guys see um, the switches inside, it's pretty cool as well. Moving on to the grill, um, two D Series lights right there, and then I got the 20 inch right here. And this right here cuts off from here to here. That's a um spot so go straight these right here they go out a little bit so it covers all angles and then up top we got the rds series um that's a 54 inch light bar and guys i'm telling you that that thing is super bright it is insane i guarantee you it's brighter than the jeep's one um, i don't know if they did some improvements with the new lights but it's just phenomenal i'll show you guys in here in a minute um under here you cannot see but we have some of the rigids um up here the green leds a series like we have on the boat and i have one on each wheel up under the fender wheel i have one on each and then i have two in the grill one in the back um i kind of want to get a little bit more to light it up but for right now that's fine um rigid's right here got the backup lights i really like those those are super bright as well it's insane pretty sick got the kick in the rest tv repping got the american flag as always guys um and go, going on to the back, I just this is my most recent thing I got done to the truck. I'm just flat black the tailgate, um, which I really like it. It kind of pops. It's something a little different, you know. Not many people have that done. I've seen a few people that have that have had that done, but really not too many people. I really like it. Haven't had any problems. Um, my buddy at, over at ZD Cal's, he did it. Did a great job. They're the ones who wrapped my boat. Um, did a phenomenal job on it. No bubbles or anything. Then moving on to the hood, I didn't show you guys this, but it's also flat black. Um, that's what I did to the Jeep as well. Indented and everything. I love that. I think it looks pretty mean. Um, but that's all the lights, guys. Um, moving on to the wheels. These are the XD Series Rockstar 2s. And um, these are just the chrome and black ones. I didn't want to get the plain black. I want something with a little bit of bling on it. Um, just something that's gonna pop a little bit more. These are the trail grafflers, um, big old tires. These are 35s. Um, I have I have this on 35s on a six inch lift, guys. I was gonna fade towards like seven, eight inch lift on 37s, but then again, I kind of wanted to stick. I didn't want to go too crazy with it. Um, took the step off, so it makes it seem like it's sitting a little bit higher. But moving on to the inside. Um, I did get subs put in this, guys, which I'll show you guys that in a minute. Um, I'll do an overview over this, but right here, this is pretty much controlling all the lights, guys. Um, right here is pretty is pretty cool. Um, it says rear lights. It actually has a middle finger sticking up. It's pretty funny. Um, second one is power. Um, it has a skull on it, which that is the whole 54-inch light bar. And then the next one is the grill light bar. Um, fourth one is passenger eject. I just fool around with people acting like there's an airbag, but that, that one doesn't do anything. Then the roadkill lights, which is the um, underglows. And then the Sasquatch lights, which are the fogs. Those things are freaking bright. Um, but that's what I have for the lights in there. That's the control panel. That's the S-Pod. Guys, moving on to the subs. I got two Rockford fossils. Some stuff back here is going to be hard to see, but there's really not too much you can see. That's my box right there. I know it's probably really hard to see, guys. Um, but I got two tins, Rockford Fosgates, and um, amps under my seat as well. I really enjoy them. Um, in my Jeep, I had two JL Audios, and those are two 10 inches as well. 
Um, and they, they're really great, they're really clean. Um, but the Rockford Frost Gates, I could get a little bit more inexpensive. And I was spending all the money on the lift, the tires, the wheels. So I was just like trying not to spend too much money, um, even though I put a lot of money into the truck. Which, And the reason why I put all this money into the truck, and I was like, I'm just going to go ahead and go all out on it. I'm going to spend all the money I can on it right now. It's because I'm going to have this all the way throughout college, guys. I'm going to have it throughout college, and who knows, probably many years after that. Um, like I said, Toyotas last a long time. And I don't see a reason why to get a new truck if this one's going to do me well. Um, as long as I keep it nice and everything, which I love keeping my stuff nice, guys. As you guys can tell, I never took my other Jeep in the in the mud as much as I wanted to. But um, I think it was super nice. But, guys, um, that's pretty much everything I got done to the truck. If you guys are wondering who did the speakers and the lights, um, ABC Marine are the ones who did that. Like I said, the ZD Cals. Um, did the flat black hood and tailgate and um, also all south auto parts did the wheels the tires and the lift on the truck and big special thanks to those companies if you're if you're in Georgia and you need some people um, definitely go check them out but big special thanks to Rigid Industries um, seriously I want to have this stuff without them and their lives are just phenomenal guys they really treated me really well they've hooked me up on the jeep they've hooked me up on the truck they've hooked me up on two boats i mean they've they've just done so much to me my dad's truck um he has the rigid grill and leds and everything as well but just big special thanks to rigid industries um they really support me a lot and that's the thing with your sponsors you guys you want to be able to communicate with your sponsors and rigid is one of the sponsors that hey if i need something i can text them or hey, if I need to talk about something, I can text them. Or if I have something coming up, I'll text them. You gotta be buddy buddy with your sponsors, and Rigid is definitely one of those sponsors. And I would highly recommend them if you want any high quality LEDs. But um, before I even end this video, I'm gonna go ahead and flicker on the light so you guys can see it. I'm pretty much just gonna have you guys looking at it right there, and I'm gonna flick on the light, which is gonna be pretty bright. I don't know, how, I don't know what it's gonna do to the camera, but I'm gonna want you to go in front of it. That's the underglows right there. We're gonna go onto the fog. That's just the fogs, those are pretty bright, which I can drive with them on. And that's both, that's, that's the RDS in the grill. Like I said, they're freaking bright, guys. It's, it's insane, it's probably blowing out the camera. Then moving on, like that's the underglows right there. They're pretty sick. Like I said, I want to get a couple more just to give it a little bit more brightness to a little more pop. Um, also, one more thing I forgot to say. Dual exhaust came with the dual exhaust. And before I did anything to it, um, it came with the stock 3-inch lift um, by Toyota. And also, it was on 33s and it had fuels. Um, these are the backup lights right here. As you can tell, I mean, look at this. Look at me. It's lighting me up right now. I mean, it's freaking bright. Lighting up the whole ground. Pretty crazy. Pretty impressive. On how bright those lights are but those fogs i really love um especially in the morning it really helps out a lot um but yeah guys big special thanks to rigid big special thanks to everybody um that is supporting me and big special thanks to my fans i mean you guys i really wouldn't be here without you guys and i would just like to say big special thanks to you guys um for following my journey and for all the support so if you guys enjoyed this video and you want to see the truck video as in with the drones with the lights on and everything please give the video a thumbs up please share this with your friends guys check out my social media sites instagram twitter facebook and also my website that's going to be coming out soon i'm going to launch a whole new site it's going to be great gonna have new baits new apparel everything so um thank you guys so much for watching please hit that like button see you guys next time yeah i forgot to say who wants a burnout <laughs>